Hi, my name is Andrew Gabaldon, and I currently live in Pflugerville, Texas. I joined the oil field because I grew up in a very Latino Mexican culture, and it's all about family. And I had my daughter at a very young age, which at that young age, you kind of realize that I just, want, I just wanted to be with her, and I needed to support her in any way possible that I could. And the oil industry was a good way to kind of know that I would be able to support and see her when I had the availability to do so. And that's the reason I went into the oil field. And I just, getting there, I saw so much things that just kind of really made me dislike being in the industry. And I tried my best to get out after that. The living situation was actually, I guess, kind of common out there, but I was living on a man camp uh, because they kind of just keep everyone together. And it's a lot of work at any point. So being there, um, you're kind of ready to work and it's just a hard situation and it kind of takes a toll on you overall because everyone's kind of eating unhealthy you could just kind of see the air pollution in the air and I know that doesn't help us the carbon dioxide that's going in and being in that area like with so much around us is actually really difficult and I just always felt tired it wasn't something like it wasn't the hardest work but because of just I guess the environment being there I was always really tired and fatigued and it just kind of made it harder to get my get the job done. It's hard to say that I regret it. Um, I don't regret going over there because like I said being Latino and needing to provide for my family it definitely helped that and I wasn't worried about money. Um, I did what I do regret is I did miss a lot of time away from my daughter because you do go out at from two weeks, like two weeks on, one week off, and that was a lot of time that did take away. Um, and I do regret knowing that I was a part of the industry that does really impact the environment and the air pollution. So that's a lot to take in, but as far as providing for my family, that's what I don't regret. I would like President Biden and the EPA to set better methane regulations in these areas to help the Latino community to have a better working and living situation.